ladies and gentlemen welcome back to my video of the sim city game as you've seen in the introduction i actually played a few cities in the cape trinity region just to have a some basic knowledge of the game and this time i'll be playing a brand new uh, region hopefully um, able to show you some basics for the beginner players and also probably you can learn something new for the more experienced pro players well at the starting menu you can see there's only two options with the options button over here and some social buttons as well um, well, we'll just check out the SimCity world first. Over here, we can actually see all the different regions of different players playing in certain regions. The headquarters, different specializations for each region also. Doesn't seem to load anything yet. Um, I'll check it out later. Hopefully, something will appear. Maybe because I don't have any regions on yet. But it's okay, you can get the idea. Then there's the challenges tab here. See, there is this upcoming challenge of a population explosion. Reach 2.5 million population in the region. Hmm, that could be a challenge. My previous playthrough of the uh, Cape Trinity region, I think I didn't really get much. I think I only reached about 250k around there for all three cities didn't play much there was just a trial run well let's take a look at the play button as you can see you got the option resume game you can create game here this way you ha can play all your different thing you can have many many uh, regions and choose which one you want to play and obviously sim city it's a multiplayer game you can actually choose the different regions, the public regions available and play with all the different types of players well for today I'll be creating a new region as I have said before um, I was mentioning I played this uh, Cape, uh, Cape Trinity for a little bit of uh, experience so that you wouldn't have to see a new playing even though I've already played SimCity games before as you can see in the Cape Trinity you only have, can have three cities and one grid works you can choose the type of city which you will be comfortable uh, the region which you will be comfortable the smallest would be this one cities, two cities and one great works very small you can go for something big like the Discovery Delta 16 cities with uh, four great works well for me I think I'll be going with the Titan Gorge hopefully I can uh, amass 2.5 million or billion was it I didn't check I didn't confirm I think should be million 2.5 million um, population I think a better chance with uh, more cities plus I can actually build uh, different kinds of cities with di different specializations um, with a bigger region so you start off with naming your region and choose your multiplayer option which is either public or private uh, well I'll be choosing the private region and won't be using the sandbox mode we'll try the challenge of uh, a normal normal built city 
then you come to the city selection option as you can see there's the circles of four great works I'll try to highlight that later on some later videos hopefully because I don't think I want to drag this video for a few hours mm, try to make it short and simple I'll give you an example of a choice of city um, this one Conestoga Crossing well, you can see there's different natural resources coal or oil and what, uh, water wind and different modes of transport that connects the city besides the normal road uh, roadways highways it's actually worth your choice uh, what kind of uh, city you want to make um, well for me I think I will start off with something simple like in uh, frontier fields it's a simple background uh, area and you just claim your city and there you go don't worry guys if you've uh, claimed a city and you see I don't want to name it you just need to wait on for a bit I think uh, in this video you, you will get to see it how I rename my city um, for this city I wouldn't make any specializations of yet maybe I'll decide it later I just want to make a basic city for this one mm, don't want to get too complicated with uh, you know sometimes you'll see people with the crop circles and um, all sorts of uh, they make the simoleon city all sorts of weird patterns um, for this one I'll just go with the basics I'll try not to um, make it too complicated uh, I'll try to have something like a much more high density uh, try to get a maximum use of the space so apologize if uh, it gets too generic with the square square layout or such so let me show you some stuff I uh, and um, some styles I've made for some of the cities well as usual they will often give you a uh, mission like in a scenario they will often come out in speech bubbles for uh, different different uh, sims they will request for different different stuff so as you can see the very first mission you'll get is a breaking ground see you draw a road that connects your highway to the city itself well before in any kind of uh, city planner game always scout your area some of the basic stuff would be the water table water map I should say as you can see the darker the blue higher higher amounts of uh, water and probably the wind direction Mm. for the wind direction as you can see it's important for building if you are building any industries you wouldn't want them to be at the upwind area you want them down over here so that if they produce any air pollution they won't really affect your citizens much right so we We've have had a look uh, of some basic data and we'll obviously need roads the most vital component of building the city itself um, you have many choices actually if you've uh, watched the uh, video from SimCities EA they have a video about roads show you all the different types of roads 
can actually start out with the low density dirt road where is um it's a small road where you wouldn't you would, where you place for the not so busy areas then you can slowly upgrade it to the low density street medium density street high density street now if you think the the, the area like for example over here i am guessing that since it's a connection point i'm guessing that the traffic is going to be quite bad one thing i like about this city is that there's this whole stretch of highway the connection of the highway is in the city itself so you can um you're not restricted to it like just one road entering for some of the cities again the uh, cape trinity you'll notice this one's uh, road entering and the whole road will be jammed up mm. you can better manage this kind of road so as you can see i've already built um, my avenue into the city then uh, let me just show you obviously you will have the zones once um, I complete this mission I think they will unlock this and then, there's, then there's also the primary buildings for your cities to run don't put this it's gonna cause you lots of issues at the start of the game obviously I think uh, without water and power the city can't run at all and there's the government buildings we'll highlight that later once we've unlocked it then there's, uh, then there's the secondary ones you'll probably need this um, once your city starts to grow and there's more population and they will need all this different stuff like waste, fire, uh, health and safety and obviously there's the additional stuff to improve the city once you have the basics done such as the education, transit and parks and last but not least obviously your disasters which you can activate at any time well don't forget to click the play button to have something going here aha city founding is approved well, seems uh, the buildings have been unlocked. So let's start off with the water tool. Just now I've mentioned we've already surveyed the water area. This is a good spot. Right at the dark section of the blue. Then there's the option of what kind of um, power supply when to build hopefully I can go for the nuclear power plant soon uh, I gotta save a lot for this I wanna go I wanna go um, for something cheap and clean actually mm, so we'll go with the wind power plant Let's hope we can get something. Um, let's see. I think I'll place one here. Then maybe I'll just do some research and hopefully I can unlock some clean oil and coal. I'll show you that show you that later. Probably in the next video. I don't think I can cover it now. Because the time constraint and such. Let's place one over here. The wind power plant. Um, this two should suffice for the moment. Later, you see, I'll be upgrading it a bit more. And obviously, the ever potent switch outflow pipe. That should um, settle with my switch. Mm, okay, so this section should be alright at the moment. Then we'll build the roadworks. Uh, later I'll highlight about this 
service road and some of the buildings that require these roads to run so you may want to leave some of uh, some space for it to expand else you'll be stuck with just a few turbines and such mm, okay we'll try to follow the snappable roads here hope it's going straight though trying to go for maximum density for this run this city I mean mm, I think this should be enough so to only plop this way okay it's parallel should be okay there you go so I'll start off with my residential. Obviously, you need residents to be living in your city before anything else. I guess continue building more roads. There we go. Add more residential areas. There we go, and then we'll start playing. Let's increase speed a bit, shall we? Wouldn't want to be playing in turtle speed for too long. Um, probably just for maybe some planning and such. Well, in the previous video, you'd have noticed that I already highlighted about the zoning. You noticed that the this is small highlighted line over here. I think that's the maximum size of your building so um, don't expect like a big tower that goes this big. So I think you wanna just take note that the you wouldn't want to build a road crossing here if you want a maximum density. Um, maximum density buildings and such. Build one over here. Build the road if I can remember where was the yep. There we go. Let's take a look. Yep. As I mentioned, see? Um if you if you watch some I think if you watch any of the other other players' videos, you just plop it all around and such. Then I think you will mix it up too much. Hmm you have like buildings built over here and then maybe it'll affect I'm not too sure about this info I'm just uh just uh just a thought and opinion because I don't think you can actually build more over here I think um unless you this is actually a starting so I think it should be okay like you see I think when the density goes up you may want to remove this section and let the buildings be built this way right so it's okay you, there's many different choices to make your city you don't have to follow my style just um where is this I'm waiting for this to come out there we go so, more residentials, put some commercial here, expand a bit more with the roads, especially when you build the avenues, you may want to take note of your cash and such, because this can cost quite a lot and you wouldn't want to be wasting all on the avenues and such
you actually have uh, different options of building. You notice, um, I build progressively. Don't really plan out the road because sometimes you see they will plan out the roads or please draw all your crop circles and such. Mm, for this one, I'll just go with simple. Uh, go with a simple format of just progressively building the the city itself. I don't put too many industries here. Let's stretch it out with a dead row. Throw it a bit further. Let's put some of here. Notice when I put the roads, it doesn't really affect my cash much. It's a cheap option, but I'll start giving problems later when the city expands and more people need to go to their wo uh, workplace in the factory region, which is over here. Mm, some industries here. Mm, probably throw some commercial areas right about here. We'll be editing this area later. Uh, you'll notice I will later build a expansion to my uh, wind power plant. Mm, this should suffice for the moment. Yes, the coal mine. I'll highlight this something later. Those are actually the specializations. Mm, I don't want to build the. Residential too near the industry part. Okay, so we'll be. I'll try to keep on building here and get more citizens in. Mm, let's see more. start actually if you if you want to you can actually place a yes there we go you notice that later I will be removing this uh, road in hopes of expanding to have a higher density buildings. For now as you can see the area is still small, don't worry. 
we can still expand. residents of uh, frontier fields mm, just give it a moment guys let's see oh actually I've already unlocked the town hall didn't really notice that that's okay as much as possible. Hmm, where's my... yes. Yep, a town hall. I can't expand much. So, don't forget the building. And with the opening of the town hall, you'll notice something. There we go. Name your city. So, welcome guys to my first city. Grand Grandview City in Symptopia. Looks good. With my new town hall. Well, um, as the population rises, that's where you can upgrade the town hall and more buildings will be available. As of now, we'll just wait and see how it goes. Um, we can expand as soon as possible. Mm, everything seems okay. You may want to add here and there. I'm just do a little bit of add-ons. Over here. Maximize the space. Click it, you'll have a, another subfolder such as the residential uh, residential demand here. We have the low, medium, and high wealth. Notice that uh, industrial demand there's only one, but when you click the industrial areas, you notice the tech level will be important. What is this? Yep, education. So that's quite, actually quite important in the long run, so don't forget to put your schools in. Mm, seems as if there's a need for 
industries again so let's expand it a bit we'll just keep giving them what they need Suffice for my industrial, I mean, let's expand it a little bit more. Okay, mm never mind, we'll just hold off there for a moment. I'll need to place one more building over there, as you'll see in a while. And what's up? You have photos of some crazy guy called Dr. Vu. Oh, yes, don't forget that um, I actually have the expansion for made as in the digital deluxe edition where you can actually build Maxis Manor where you have the hero of Symtopia to save the day uh, Maxis Man then obviously there will with every hero there's always a villain to go along Dr. Vu's tower Usually in the, some of the more criminal kind of city, kind of specializations will be great with a blue tower. But we'll hold on, we'll hold off with that first. Um, we'll see this guy over here, maybe I'll place him somewhere behind my town hall. Oh, did you look at that? My city has grown quite well, and as the Population rises. So that's my upgrades. So with every upgrade, with this uh, upgrade to City Hall, you notice there's a new option now. There's the edit option where you can actually choose to build a sign. Yes, the ever important sign to show that this is the City Hall. Then there will also be all the different departments. Just having a look there. Uh, Simcopter one. I'll probably put that uh, later on. You need an airport for that. Um, for me, my suggestion usually is um, to build the department of utilities first. As you can see, we have the more advanced buildings for utilities. So that um, we can build a more cleaner uh, and more efficient city from the start. Well, if you build a department over here, it affects all your other cities in uh, different regions and uh, different cities in the region, I should say. So you don't have to worry. Once you build one place, you can actually go to another city and build uh, another department over there, and it will affect this city also. we will be in the oh, 14k so it'll take quite a while to get there we'll be before we do so let's um, check out some of the buildings where it's needed there you go you are ready mm, like I said just now there's the primary one this is the secondary buildings where you actually need the trash city gets bigger, you will want to expand. Uh, let's put a row, let's try to be more organized too. You're gonna put your trash. It's gonna be actually quite cheap you know. Mm, this you'll notice something. There's this uh, big red box over here. Um, that's actually your upgrades in the edit menu so you may not want to build it something like this and um, it will affect the uh, 
uh, upgrade and such. But for me, I think I'll just keep it for the moment. Why? Because um, I don't think I want I would want to keep the garbage dump for too long. And um, for the start, you don't want to be get, getting too excited and build everything. You know, like if the city only requires a, a small amount space such as just one dump zone should be okay you don't have to go all like you know build service roads and build all the dump zones right at the start of the city because it doesn't really require require it yet well as the city expands don't forget to check your power supply and such looking good power supply water supply let's check you out um, let's show you here huh? let's click over here there we go. Water supply. Plenty of water. Will suffice. Looking good. Alright. As you can see, as the city expands, they'll demand more items such as the clinic. I'll build a clinic somewhere here, hopefully. There's enough space to expand. Uh -huh. So I think we will see that too. And try to build it here, it goes with. Um so let's build one over here. Should cover this guys. Right, so for the clinic, you can see that's the reason why that was red. But um I don't think I will need to build it over here though. I'll need the ambulance suffice for this mm, good spot to build here well don't forget the ever popular sign to show that it's a clinic well, I don't need to expand it yet should be okay for the moment mm, let's see city hall looks okay we've got a little bit of space here so let's expand where's my guide? yes there you are my trusty guide you guide me uh, seems to be having a space problem here separator Residents should be coming in soon. Okay, like I mentioned, we want to put the secondary priority buildings next. Uh, already place the garbage, the health. Probably want to go for fire next because we wouldn't want this whole area to be burnt down. Should be studying. Oh uh, man, look at this traffic. Don't worry guys, I'll be expanding soon. Should be okay though. Mm. Alright, just for the sake of it, I'll just expand. So the sims won't get so mad with this horrible traffic. place this uh, clinic too early. I should have built the avenue through first before I place the clinic. Because if you bulldoze this area, just to take note, you'll destroy the clinic as well. So we, we wouldn't want that. I uh, wanna build the fire station next. Uh, at this time I won't place it um, at the the expanding road okay what say we just 
place the road where I need first so that we won't have any issues later. There we go. The big avenue road. So that we won't have much issues. Okay. So we want to put our fire department next. the fire department you have a choice today you can actually put it somewhere here uh, facing the avenue there isn't much expansion for this uh, small this uh, small fire station mostly it's just a expand expansion of um, fire truck uh, how should I put it a uh, fire station garage well, for this kind of buildings, don't forget to place the fire station flagpole. Mm, my suggestion actually is to put the bell first, because um, this actually helps with the response time. Well, once you've unlocked the department of uh, safety, I think. Will be able to build this uh, large fire station. I see, okay. Fire stations up and running. Uh, some flag raising ceremony there. Soon the fire uh, firefighters will be up and about in your city. No one touched this road yet. The next thing, obviously. Oh, what's up with these guys? Really flim? Oh man. Really? That fast? Yeah. Okay, let's hope. Uh, I don't think I'll have enough yet. We need uh, 12k for that. Because of a big population city. Too fast there. Let's see what these guys want. Aren't you hand scrobal? Can our Japan but nurse to us? Ah. You see, as we progress, don't forget to check out what your sims need. You can see they want to be throwing a giant block party all night. Toss a bit of more garbage, blah blah blah, okay. You notice that um, the reward is good though. So, one thing you will want to know is when there's something like this, you want to expand just a little bit, don't go too overboard and spend too much just for the um, extension, expansion of the garbage, garbage dump. Well, hopefully I can clear this mission and get um, 25k so can I can at least uh, build the expansion for the clinic and also um, have enough for the police we want to want it want this area to be infested with, with crime in the early goings of the game well the city is running quite well at the moment as you can see everything is um, just nice nice and quiet don't forget as the buildings go up Get all my important buildings, such as uh, water and power and such. Everything seems okay. Don't worry, sewage. Let's go into the sewage outflow pipe. So it's okay. Um, actually, I don't really like the sewage outflow pipe much. I'm trying to go for the sewage treatment plant as soon as possible. Mm, so that wouldn't have much ground pollution and try to reduce the amount of pollution for this uh, city. Okay, I guess I didn't need to wait for my hippie guy to give money. Let's build you. There we go. You can see you can expand it a bit more. I think it should suffice, don't go too overboard because it will cut into your uh, income. 
once uh, you build too much see you just build one um, clinic and the price of uh, the expenses has increased a bit so let's take a look at our clinic now should be able to uh, have a treatment capacity of uh, 25 this time. Mm, so do I. Actually, I'm having a bit of uh, flu at the moment, so you guys don't mind the voice at the moment. Mm, I'm hoping to expand a bit so that I can. Also, actually, quite a big mistake here. In the clinic. So I should have built the avenue first before placing the clinic down. But it's okay. Learn from mistakes. Mm, I think I can actually put the commercial area here over here. Yeah, for the meantime, probably um, remove it later. I have mentioned about the density size since there's a demand. We'll just build it. Try to mix it match a bit. Mm, something to take note, I will need to remove this. I'll need to change the area over here. Lots of editing to do. That's the hopefully it's uh, that's the Money increases. Oh, I think I already completed the mission. I think I'm talking too much and didn't even notice. Well, not forgetting the police. It's important so they, they can um, do their patrols ASAP. Let's do some roads a bit. Where's my road panel? Showing me the uh, there we go. It showed me for a while and it disappeared. That was weird. Hey, where is my yes? This was what I was looking for. It's kind of annoying sometimes. I don't show you what I need. Wasting precious smolens and what's up with this? Okay, here we go. Precious smolens on um, something like that. Quite a big space though. side instead. Mm. So I don't want too much space in between the both zonings. I'll be wasting precious land. <coughs> be wasting precious land in between. So the commercial seems to be going up. Build some more residentials, some more commercials, and I seem to have been distracted because I needed to build my police station. There you go. Police station, you only need the right hand side of the police station. This is highlighted red. So we'll build you. How about I build it over here so I can use the main road? There we go. Police is done. For the police station, you can see. Don't forget to add the trusty flag. The police sign. Pop cars will leave it for, leave it for later. Um, jails also should be okay for the moment. So as you can see. We've already covered the important buildings for expanding a bit more. You can see what is this guy? Hey man! 
Oh, is this uh, fireworks? Fireworks mission. Oh, if you're confident, you can actually go for it, which I shall. But not forgetting, you just need to build uh, one more fire truck to cover the fire coverage a bit. That's a lot though, 15k. Should be okay now. Let's hope our fire department can do the job. Well, let's just take a look. Don't notice. Just ignore this section. Because the. Um, because of the scenario and such. Let's go, fire stations. Well, let's hope that they can accomplish that mission for me so that I can have at least a 15k. Let's need to wait for one more hour, as in the same city hour. Alright. Next important thing, don't forget to build a great school because you wouldn't want uh, dumb sims like I mentioned before for the industry to expand you'll need the sims to be educated so as if you have enough which I don't have right now okay there we go when you expand don't forget to ensure that all the white boxes are not covered by any buildings there we go so we have a school running now so with the school running don't forget to place your bus stops so that the students have a way to travel to school I don't think there's any other option in this city yet because they haven't placed any bus shuttle buses and such I don't think they take shuttle buses to school like uh, how we do they all rely on the school bus try to make it as organized as possible uh, I've been playing the uh, cities in motion Notice that uh, you gotta place all your um, all your stops. I don't think they have these uh, same criteria for this game. Oh, some school red. The oh well. Have less than five fires. To build one more for you, my friends. Which I don't have any smallions, so let's stick with these two guys doing the job. But with the bulldoze too, don't forget to remove all the unwanted buildings. Oh well, it's worth a try. They ask me. Yes, I can notice that. Ask me later. Don't have the simulation as of yet. So, with a school, forgot about this. Don't forget the flag raising ceremony for the school um, I can only build okay there we go probably want to put one more bus slot there I think it should be okay 
we'll see it in the morning how it goes hopefully we can cover as much as possible of the zones Don't forget to add on to your school buses. So everything is like expanding well. It's pretty good now. Notice we only have. Let's take an example here. Uh, Davis residence. People are dying all around us. Yes, that's why you gotta take a look at the certain stuff as you build. <laughs> mm, I really want to remove this and build a proper clinic. It's gonna take. It's gonna cost me though. Okay. It's quite a waste to remove this guy. But I have no choice because I need to expand. This why is quite. Weird. Bad spot. Probably I'll build another clinic for temporary reasons. Mm, you probably want to expand this section again. Okay. Have an idea. issues let's take a look at the budget panel over here expenses income you can raise your taxes reduce taxes for all the different uh, different uh, zones when you unlock the department of finance from the city hall you will have options for the low medium and high wealth residents mm. let's see if you don't have enough cash, you can go for bonds. See, you need the part of finance for the bigger bonds. So for the moment, I'll just stick to my own, own income. We'll build you here, my friend. There you go, lots of health, which is gonna affect my cash look at that 1100 just for two clinics uh, don't think we can expand it as of yet but we'll expand it later so, uh, mm, call the fire department I think yeah should be some fire issues Let's take an example of um, one of these buildings here. The Basu residence. Let's take a look. Well, you can see there is the land value which will increase over time, which shows you the different wealth residence. This, this one has the potential to go up even more. And there's also the density. Uh, this um, bar over here which will also increase over time 
so that um, more bigger buildings can be built. So you can see this is all the small density areas, so you don't really need the high density roads as of yet. And that's why you can build this small dirt road here, so that um, we can maximize this space for the start. Alright, so everything seems to be okay. Okay, let's not mention about the school. There seem to be issues with schools because there's too many students for two little classrooms. Okay, for these buildings like the school, you'll notice that you can place this one over here. 10k should be enough. But something special about it is that they have top floor ones. This really is good. Try and try to utilize any uh, second floor buildings so that um maxima uh, minimizes the space required. Then yes, actually I wanted to do this. There we go. The ever popular sign it shows is a fire station. I like put all these signs. Police should be okay. Got the classrooms running. Play by the next day. Uh, 350 should be enough. Mm, and now you can notice in my additional section over here. The police seems to be going up. Let's talk about the expanding of the wealth residence. There's different options. You can limit the um, the types of uh, residence and commercial from the buildings over here. So if you build something like basic and you don't have any uh, medium wealth buildings nearby, like the ones over here, the base wall fill and such, then the um, residence will remain as a medium wealth. Or you can go for the high wealth residence. The ones over here, I'll probably block one somewhere. Utilize as much space. There you go. So with the placement of um, this big park plaza over here, what's this? Yes, a tiered urban green space for high wealth residents notice that some of the buildings will start to upgrade itself to a medium one. I you have many different options actually you can actually go slowly through the nature and sports one then go for plaza and formal but um, I just want to save the effort later so that I don't have to um, place it anymore you see some medium residence is coming up. So I clicked on some guy. Somebody must have died somewhere. Oh no, they were laughing. What you get worried about? See the patients, okay. Looking good. Patients over here also looking good. Mm, I think Kick Linux is really taking a toll on my budget here. So I may want to remove one. I can actually expand my it's, uh, high avenues here. So I apologize. Little fans over here is being triggered. See you again. When something like that happens, try to be fast, have sufficient resources to expand. Simoleons. I think uh, we we'll need to expand it a bit more later. Okay, we haven't been been building any. Oh, hold on, let's take a look at this guy. Would it be a tourist town? 
interesting. Uh, I don't want to be a tourist. Don't want this to be a tourist town yet. Probably build something else later. Then. This is the Expo Center. That's actually more of the tourist line. Maybe later. We have the small example. I already have like three k for a city, which is actually quite horrible. Consider. Um, let's build a little bit different for this section. I'll build you this way. There you go, something different. Although, is the. Oops, yeah, I've made a mistake here. It's okay. Mistakes happen. Just need to edit a bit. Don't know if I have that lined up properly. Uh, nope, I don't have it lined up properly. It's okay though. Simulans again. It's gonna wait one hour, same hour I mean. You can see there's the time over here. It's um May of the year one. Oh, it's only five months. I think I'll try to go for a December and see we we'll, we can what we can have from there. Area. Mm, 
let's see what's going on here. Take part in the cities, more bucks, okay. Then you shall have more bucks. Put something big though. Place a fountain park. Where was it? Reflecting pool park looks nice. I don't want to put too much to the end though. Because um, it's actually wasting the coverage. So, I want to put somewhere. Uh, this guy seems to be having issues with needing a park. So, I'll stick one somewhere here. There you go. What are you happy now? Plop a park. Uh, city mansions start going up, and you can see the building size is also increased. It's very really nice. Oh, suddenly this this uh, big one, a high lot residence suddenly come up. Oh, good, it's expanding well. Mm, we haven't checked out our school. Let's see if we had enough. Let's see. What do you mean? Yes. More classrooms. Don't forget. The children is always the priority of the city. Um, seems to be a little bit of conflict here. Can we build on here? So. I mean, you only have a max of four. Oh, yes, I forgot. Can actually build the second floor. Don't forget to maximize the utilize as in utilize the second floor. And the classroom, you guys should be okay. Got some cash for that, hopefully. I don't know, forgot. Haven't built my Maxis Manor for Maxis Man to go on patrol. And put him right behind my city hall so that it can be easily called, I guess. Um, don't think that's how it works. Air pollution seems to be rising. Okay, it's okay. You can see the apartments are going up. Looks okay. Yes, all the bigger buildings. To go to a, as you can see, as the transition to the um, medium, uh, let's say, um, medium density buildings will start to go up higher. Hopefully, we can go for something like a high density buildings. Accomplish my mission for the maximum density. Everything seems to be okay, let's take a look at our patients. Soon I think I have to upgrade a bit. Some expenses, take a look at some expenses. Alright, as you can see the as the higher wealth people come in. Um clean up my act. So too, I'll do it. But don't forget for the more specialized buildings, it's gonna cost a bit more, such as uh, 111k. As mentioned before, it's actually quite an expensive building. It's okay. That happened. It's quite annoying actually. How could they do that to me? Okay, okay, let's go with something different. You can see you can make some square roads. So that I guess. Oh shit! So the way they looked, this is a this building is taking a look. There is a tornado coming. Holy crap. Lucky's all the way in the corner over here. People 
it should be running for the legs. Okay, so the tornado just sticks to this area. Actually quite lucky with this one. Oh. There we go. Zero destruction. Well done. Well, no, not okay. We really have a clinic. I think the issue of them is actually to have more ambulance bringing them to the clinic itself. Oops, I forgot to put the sign. Uh, okay, I'll just expand it. A few more people will be coming in. Mm, 10,000. I will save that for a moment. I was just about to build my roads over here when I was distracted by the tornado. Um, mention something about shift clicking this. Let's see if it works. There you go. Cycling center, lots of uh, high, high demand items. Hey, since when you can go in Lama speed? I want in, in uh, Cheetah speed. It's faster. Mm, as you can see, don't forget to take note of the different departments. Probably need more fire trucks running. Damn, this is about to build a Maxis Man Mansion. Gotta place more of these fire trucks. This guy seems to be okay. I want to expand this area. Um, let's take a look at this section here. Build oops, too curvy. Can you just build a nice circle road? Seeing there's some some guys they've made the crop circle city. It's quite interesting though. Probably try it in the further as in the next city probably. So I want the straight road man. Give me straight road. the way to the edge. I think I have accomplished the um, the health issues. Oh, seems to be a problem here with the roads. Yep. It's okay. I'll build you here. Should I? Okay. Build a me 
medium road but more commercial I guess that's what they need so commercial buildings here you see one thing about this city these two sections I can actually put the high as in the avenues hold on guys don't forget to do some clearing of these buildings if you are wasting the ample space okay commercial should be coming up soon some commercial zones here a bit. Let's actually put the small one. Like this one. The small turbines. Got the sign. I didn't put the sign. Oh my gosh. So important. The sign. And also, if you want to expand, you can actually place the little dirt roads here. Oh, I don't know. Smooth terrain. Why is that? I'll have to remove these guys soon. Or you can go for the really big turbine, which I'll maybe place it later. For now, I think I'll stick with the small turbines. Hopefully, they will suffice. There you go. It's more than enough, I guess. Don't place too much. Let's take a look at our water supply. Seems to be okay. We don't want to have too many water bombs in um, one area. We don't want to dry out the water supply. Uh oh. The sewage seems to be creeping into my water supply here. So I probably want to place it a little bit further. And put you over here. Sorry guys. Here. <coughs> I can demolish a few guys' homes. Well, it's for the sake of the of the Hold on guys. Okay. I think we gotta wait for a while for the power to move on over. Well, let's take a look at this area here. Seems to have uh, expanded a bit. I'll slowly expand as the city gets bigger um, this is all okay this is all commercial buildings I'm sure if they will build this area I guess they will So everything is up and running nicely. The aim is to get to at least a 15k to expand the town, uh, city hall, I should say. Patience, okay, everything's good here. We probably want to build more fire trucks, I guess. Seems to be lots of fire issues. Must be 200 per hour. This fire issue still has to be increasing. Okay, it's feel safer. There's lots of fire safety. Don't forget to check your bulldoze bottom. As you can see, there's abandoned buildings. I probably guess is here. Industry always.
garbage dump, there's the same building method as the power plant. I think it should be okay, there's only 24 over 70 tons of trash. Hmm. I haven't built my recycle tank. I had this uh, mission for quite a while, so I'll probably go for the Maxis Manor. No, I think I can actually build the that's my house. So we're here. I'm trying to make it straight. The uh, thing is okay for this one. And then there's some roots and I don't think that my house can be really much. Superhero, which is running around, as you can see, waiting for a job to do. He's just patrolling his manor. As you can see, he will expand to the renowned points, which is required for his landing pad and his turbo machine garage. Being something like a Batman kind of superhero. And in order to increase his renown points, you'll need him to go save the injured. Actually, I have to pay him since he's quite a selfish guy. So, let's send him for a mission. There he goes. You can see him going there. On his little Maxis Man car. Let's take a look what happened. It's a pleasure to know you too, Dr. Maxis Man. Oh, it's Dr. Maxis Man. And then Dr. Boo, blah blah blah. Okay, don't worry. So we'll just have to heal some sins. As that's his power, heal some sins. Oh, whoa, whoa. I see, there seems to be quite a bit of protesting here. What about this guy's one? There's too many germs. I believe it's true because of these ones here. I forget to remove this. Oh, there's a fire here. Probably, oh yes, I did demolish that. We will put a fire station somewhere here. Why not yet though? You will want to expand and make sure your city. Let's see. Hold on. Hold on. It's the nefarious Dr. Wu. I don't want to build him in this city. So I'll remove him. I don't want to. Okay, I think because of the road works, I guess. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, so we have something running here. Um, everything seems to be okay at the moment. Injured seems to be okay. Uh, wrong building, sorry. 
fire is the only issue we're having right now. Not too sure why, I think the fire is to spread. Morning. And the firefighters is ah! compiling. Seem to be going together. Because we are all the different fires. Once again, seems to be left with one more fire here. Take a look at my water supply. Do I need to remove this guy? No, nope, should be okay. I'm trying to save up for the recycle plant. Hopefully, Max's man's doing his job. Uh, no, just back in space. Did he heal any symptoms? Not too sure. So let's send him out again. He will cost every 500. I'm gonna pay him 500 just to save your city. Said, a selfish guy. There we go. Our nice little avenue here. I think I want to expand it a little bit over here and build a network for my industrial area there's room to expand um, seems to still have fire issues somewhere Maybe I can actually build the avenue over here it's quite a big uh, tough decision here You know, we wouldn't go for the um, avenue yet. Let me just show you a little bit of the uh, road grids. This button over here. So as you can see, I have a small dirt road. We can be upgraded to the low density street to accommodate for uh, uh, traffic issues. Connection here. There we go. Try to build some where we will connect buildings. Don't forget that these uh, normal uh, normal roads can can cannot be upgraded to the avenues, but the avenues can go all the way up to the density streetcar avenues. Those are the streetcars actually the mass transit system. See all the buildings are going up. I'll just add on a little bit here and there. More commercials. Okay, looking good now. They seems to need some more industrial, so let's give them more industrial buildings. Mm. Let's build you over here. Don't forget to leave space for the truck. Um, probably not build too much of that. I don't want to have um, too much. As in, I don't want to uh, be relying on this, on the garbage dump. I want to change it to a recycling center soon. Mm, I'll build a one more road over here. So 
so we can maximize the space. I feel like they have gone all the way, but it's okay. Let's take it to this. For the moment. Um, expansion seems to be good, everything's being okay. Let's see what these guys want. Okay, we are considered a small city. Yes, it's actually quite a small city now. We need at least 15,000 people. Yeah, that should be soon. Wait, maximum. Oh, okay. We need to heal some sims. Don't forget to take a look at um, our Mr. Max's man here. He, he costs quite a lot, huh? You can see 900 for expenses. So he does his job well. I'm not sure about this actually though. No. I think we will unlock as the Maxis Man headquarters expands. Mm. Let's see what buildings are here. Oh, okay, it's industries. I'm trying to go for the clean industry as soon as possible, which is actually the education. We actually need the university and such so that the tech level will go up. Let's take a look at a bit of our education. Hmm. Didn't, didn't see this coming. Okay, so we can see purple means not enrolled. So we have not been keeping an eye on the students for a while. So, yes, this is the reason. As you noticed, we didn't put any bus stops for our students to go to school. Which caused an issue with... You can just take a look at why these people's are the, the people are bending the okay. mostly due to fire so it used to be an issue with fire issue all around town. It's a spread a lot though. Yes, you have abandoned buildings? Yes I do. Industries usually will have the abandoned buildings the most. CPF, okay, normal. Fire is slow, okay, what to do with this fire I'm slow today? Oh. Sorry about that. Something got too loud. You can see, this city is uh, connected by this uh, railway track. Uh, maybe make use of it later. Of, uh, some ways to expand the city. Uh, well, talking to you guys, I managed to have enough to build. Yes, I think you would have noticed it as well. But you couldn't tell me. Uh, let's build the recycling plant and remove the. Garbage dump. Should I? Because I noticed that the garbage tends to ground pollution. Let's see what happened to my ground pollution there. Yep. Tons of ground pollution in this area. Because of the industries. But it's okay, hopefully with the recycling center built we can reduce the ground pollution in this area recycling center actually is quite big let's see if i can do some editing here it's actually taking this whole area mm, i shall put you here there we go. Finally, after so long, we have the 
garbage dump up and running as in this recycling plant I'm sorry about that recycling center up and running okay for this uh, recycling center you notice that they recycle all the items and some things you want to note is a the recycling collection truck the reclamation delivery truck to deliver the plastics to other businesses if they need them this is to collect all the recycled materials all, all over the city and obviously the reclamation line at the moment I think we only have the plastic one we can actually expand it a bit and you'll see that um, this recycling plant will actually help Residents should be soon. Max is man. Oh yes, I forgot about that. It's quite tedious as the city gets bigger. You will have to keep an eye on lots of stuff. Okay, like this, for example, see now it's start, starting to the responsibilities are starting to build up on me. I'll need a one more classroom here. Okay, Maxis Man has killed 3 sims 10k does for that And I managed to cover my grade school Okay, let's hope that uh, the grade school is enough Okay, it's now um, for this size of the city Forget that we need to collect the garbage. So don't forget to place um, these garbage trucks. I should say um, recycling trucks. I can't really do it. It's okay, I'll put it to the main road here. Send out more. Cycling trucks. And probably I will expand it with uh, once I have the trade center, which I, I will show you later. The reclamation truck, delivery truck will send the collected alloys and such to the trade center for trading. Turbo time. He wants to build his uh, turbo machine. Turbo machine I can raise two minutes faster. Okay, we'll just stick to that. I think for the turbo machine, I'll need 500. Was that right? Yes. Okay, so we just go slow and steady. I'll let him do his job. Continuously come back to the Maxis Man and try to increase his um, renown as soon as possible. Let's take a look at our city now. Residential, commercial. We had our um, buildings going up. Don't forget to place more parks and such to increase the land value. I'll put you over here. Probably put a sculpture garden. Or a little bit formal. How about a reflecting pool park over here? No, I don't put it in the corner like I said. I'll put you over here then. Try to cover this guy. 
this. Put you over here. There we go. Hopefully this uh, will help with the higher wealth residents to come in. You don't want to be sticking to the low wealth for too long. Here we go. We need these guys. Go check out. Oh yes, don't forget of our police and obviously the water supply because it's pumping polluted water. So we we'll want to remove this. When one this, I think that's the cause of our jet problem. So we want to remove that and place a water tower somewhere. It's just at the brink of the yellow band there. So maybe we don't have to go with the. We don't have to go with the um, um, water pumping station, as you say. That's okay. <coughs> we can go with the normal water pumps for. It's got a cost quite a lot. Sometimes you notice that you'll be getting quite a lot of uh, your income is quite steady. You don't get too excited and start building your um, police precinct and all these big buildings too soon because it will suddenly affect your the budget suddenly. Like you see, this one goes for 400,700. This is placing like uh, two two police stations is more than enough for a small city like this one rather than a police precinct. That was one of the issues I actually had for um, my previous cities. I got too excited and built too many um, uh, higher level buildings I should say which uh, had took a toll on my budget nothing much to build actually I think the jail cells not catching much not catching much of uh, criminals uh, police, fire what was the issue with fire I guess where is my fire station sorry I lost my fire station for a moment here oh there you are Salable to like that. Before you plan on on building another fire station, always try to go for a maximum expansion. had uh, reduced for a bit. I guess because uh, there were buildings being built. It's okay, you will see suddenly um, as these uh, buildings go up, we get to, to worry. As the buildings start to get built. This one, see, there's the high density. The population will suddenly increase. So don't worry too much about that. How about my power supply? Okay, still sufficient. Worried about the bigger buildings we which are coming in soon. Which might affect the power supply suddenly. So yeah. Um yes. Mr. Dr. Max's man's patrol. start to go up as you can see it shall close you see this section is getting quite big grow so don't worry <coughs> I probably go for the department of education next so that I can build a university and start researching on some uh, useful buildings which I can use. Even build some great works also. Mm -hmm. This section seems to need a park. Something small, shall we? 
Oh, we can go with something bigger so that... Oh, it looks nice. Panama Tourism. Something pool park. Same size. Let's hope no more high wealth people will come in. Increase my... Uh, income. Commercial wealth. Okay, everything seems to be going up. Business per day. Recycling center. Okay. Think gotta work more on the recycling center bit. Oh, recyclables. Why is that? Seems to be having some issues here. Where's all my recycling trucks? Some dead or... Some recycling trucks not going around. Not too sure about this part though. What happened to the recycle... Uh, what happened to the trucks? Because they ain't, ain't going for their runs I guess. Got plenty of trucks actually. Oh well. We'll ignore that for a moment and take a look at um, some other stuff. Students. Okay. Should be heading to school soon. It's uh, 7 a.m. So, how about my patients? Okay, patients are doing good as well. I'm gonna save and um, probably build a brand new sewage treatment somewhere over here. And remove my uh, sewage outflow pipe over here. It seems disgusting. You can see all the poop all running around. Sewage dumping into the environment. So much sewage for the tanks to hold. Okay. So, once this has been built, we can remove our filthy sewage treatment outflow pipe. There we go. supposed to remove the garbage dump yet mm, nothing about garbage over here no issues with garbage I guess seem to be collecting now okay they're actually collecting for me the Recyclables. 
see where the, um, the trash menu. Okay, seems to be lots of trash over here. Recycling and garbage. Okay, we want to note that um, as the education level goes up, then your your um, garbage will turn to recyclables. As you can see the higher should be some educated guys, they will start to recycle stuff. I think you shouldn't have um, demolished the garbage garbage center yet. But let's hope for the best. We'll recycle as much as possible. The oh, they didn't. They're like going in circles. Gotta wait for them to go back to the um, the recycling center and see whether the recycling works. There, there, there we go. Seems to be going too. See any production going? There we go. Cycling is on the way. Very nice. So we have some recycling going on here. Uh, I'm still waiting for my residents to be coming in. There's still too much issues of a germs. Health risk. Let's take a look at health risk here. Uh, germs map. Too much issues with the uh, germs and uh, ground pollution. I think it's due to the um, switch outflow pipe. It's okay. These guys will be treating the sewage for a while. I think the uh, auto pumping station can actually filter the. Mm. Well, this changes over time, so we we'll just have to wait for it. Well, everything seems to be okay. Access plan continuously no, to send out for missions. So don't forget to send them out. Um, probably build some um, buildings over here. And these two buildings. Why is that? Seems to be a problem here. What's the problem? It's okay, guess we'll skip him. And build a crooked road. Hmm. Should be interesting. Probably um, build a curvy road and build it to you. Okay, that should be better. <laughs> Let's build. Can you? Oh, this one can go straight. So you'll remain there. his uh, patrol was. Mm, there's the demand for zoning. As you can see the residential seems to be going up. Go 
couldn't build the maximum over here, but it's okay. Probably I did that later. going up. Mm, not too sure I want to build much over here. We'll leave it for the moment. I haven't really made my upgrade of the avenue yet. This is, I think it's going to cost quite a lot. But it's wasting some valuable space. Mm, I'm hoping to go have a trade center running. That's one of the specializations. As you can see, I've made it 15k to the next next stage. Don't forget to upgrade. Too many germs. It's okay guys. Okay, so once you upgrade, don't forget to place the mix. So I want to build a department of education. And I'll probably put it over here since it seems to be separate. A separated building. Let's put it here. There we go. So now the industry is going through medium density. Okay, so as you can see, there's the need for a medium density area. We have our department of education running, and we will probably have issues. Yes, we're having issues with garbage, so that means I did make a mistake there. We will need to have a garbage dump first.
until the education level goes up and then you can expand to a recycling center so that was a sorry it was my mistake there I didn't notice that but it's okay we learn from mistakes so as you can see we are now in the next level of cities hopefully our garbage trucks can collect ASAP the garbage so um, as uh, you see seen we've uh, chosen the education to go for next to wait for uh, more students and such in the city. I have actually unlocked the public library. It's a actually good for the students to come and study. I guess. Oh, there's problems over here. Mm. We'll need more students. As you can see, I'll try to aim for more students, okay, there we go, school's up and running, let's hope that the students goes to school, in order to do so, make sure there's sufficient school buses to send them to school, we want to max out the school buses, it's okay, going to be costly but also not forgetting to build your school buses to send your students to school We'll build one more park over here for higher. Mm, hold, on, hold on, there's Need some roads running here. So you should be at the density of roads. I'll come back, come back to that in a while. Let me just expand this city a bit. Bit better. Let's there we go. Okay, so there was this uh, notice of the industry trying to uh, expand. So density seems to want to go up but the roads forbid it so let's go to medium roads so you can see them the petition for a high school has been approved seems to be going up so it's okay I can just spend for my industry so that I can expand and hopefully the industrial demand will decrease because I don't want to have too many factories for this city oh Education building seems to be unlocking now. Come back to that in a while. Mm. Let's just finish it. Okay. So, industry should be going up. Higher density buildings. We want to work on the education now. Mm, let's find a nice spot to put my schools don't forget as you build the schools expenses will be increasing mm, probably put one over here and see the community college actually helps with the industry so it probably built somewhere over here 
think for a moment. Okay. Seems to be a good idea. We'll probably build the college somewhere here and probably a high school. Somewhere over here. Okay. The college will actually help with the industry. So, um, I don't want to be putting it to next to the treatment plant because it will affect the expansion. Flag and this one. Let's see. So hopefully the tech level will increase as you've seen the college will help with that. Will increase the tech level of nearby industrial buildings so that the we can go for something uh, cleaner. video and uh, lots of decent buildings going up here library mm, probably need to increase the students so I may want to build my high school before that don't forget power supply is down it's probably the reason we're having some issues Oh, we can actually go this way actually. I didn't notice. So yeah. Hey hey hey. Don't worry. That should control my there we go. These guys, but I need this piece. This time, however, I'll go with something bigger. And the large one. Um, this is really uh, quite a space-consuming power supply. Let's go and see whether it works. No, I think still need one more. Okay, this 
uh, put one more just for good measure. So that we don't have to worry about our power for quite some time. As these um, turbines spin, you can see the power supply will go up as well. It's all depending on the wind direction. Just wait for a while for the power supply to go up. Yes, I guess that was the reason why most of the buildings weren't weren't having any um, having any workers and such. Seems okay. Everything seems to be okay now. I should place my high schools next. to hold up for the university um, put you over here in between the highway and the normal road then okay so we have a high school running There's enough space for expansion. Sorry, classes over here, I guess. Um, these classrooms. This is a gymnasium. In build, actually. It's quite interesting. Don't forget your sign to show that this is a high school. Okay, so the education levels seems to be going up quite well. We'll want to do more buses soon. Let's hope in the morning. Let's take a look. Oh yes, we're ready. Going to spawn up the students now. Okay, that's good. I'm saying we're going to get the students. So, Let's go to the starting area and see all the buildings. It's gone up quite a bit. All as planned. Should be a show with the um, probably need to build one of this pretty soon because there seems to be issues with the pollution. I still have not yet built the avenues yet. Well, um, if you don't drag this video for too long, it's a good starting city for the moment. Not much issues. As you see, we only have issues with the zoning, which is the expansion of the city. But um, I'll stop this video right over here and um, probably continue with the increased education, uh, mass transit and probably take a look at a specialization also. I well, hope you enjoyed this uh, first video of uh, my city in the uh, Symptopia region. This is uh, Grandview City and hope you stay tuned for the next the continuation of Grandview City of uh, the specializations and probably some other stuff I can showcase to you. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for the next one and see you guys around. Bye!